Hey everyone, Nunu here and welcome to another Stardew Valley video. And today I'm going to talk about how you can get um, basically all the star drops on the game. Uh, and if you don't know what a star drop is, basically it's that item that you eat and it allows you to um, evolve your character so you can have more energy and more hit points. But before starting this video, I'm going to ask you guys if possible to subscribe to the channel uh, turn on the notification so you can know when I'm going to release a new video or when I release a new video. Um, leave a like into this video also, that would be awesome. Let's try to get as many likes or as many thumbs up as possible. Um, also, leave a, uh, a comment down below if you want to. Just um, tell us something if you, if you have anything to say about this video, I think or I guess. But anyways, let's start this video. So, there are a few ways you can get uh, star drops. And I'm gonna try to talk about them all. Um, I'm gonna try to show footage of them also. Um, let's see if I can get, uh, although I know how to get them all, uh, it doesn't mean I have footage to show you guys. But anyways, the first way you can get, and probably is gonna be the easiest way or one of the first ways you can get um, the, the, the star drop is if you get 2000 tokens uh, tokens I'm sorry on uh, the Stardew Valley Fair and you can do that by winning some activities I the easiest way is by um, betting on the color for the spinning wheel um, I'm not really sure what color always win, but there is one that normally always wins, and I think it's the green. I'm not completely sure, but um, I will probably leave that because I'm not sure right now. Uh, I'm going to 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 leave an, uh, a note um, down in the description and also here in here right now in the video. So I am telling you right now what color you have to bet. And basically, when you get the 2,000 tokens, then you can go to the um, to the guy. I don't, you know, you can exchange the tokens for the fruit, and that's the first or one of the first ways to get it. Second way, probably the second easiest way to do it is to reach the level 100 on the mines, and there you can. There is a chest. You open it, and you get a, a star drop. Another easy, another kind of easy way is if you get your uh, wife or husband to be um, fully hearted with you. So um, the maximum level, I think it's 12 hearts. But if you get the 13 heart, you will receive the star, ju uh, the star drop uh, from your husband or wife. Basically, you will get a comment about life on the farm and how they are enjoying it. And then they will give you the star drop fruit as a thank, um, um, the star drop fruit exactly, as a thank, um, thank you gift, basically. Another way that you could say it's not, not hard, you just need to get and reach to that level, is to buy the, um, the star drop from Krobos. Um, Krobos is like that ghostly creature that lives in the sewers and you can buy it for 20k or 20,000 um, yeah exactly 20,000 gold coins or 20,000 dollars I don't know how you pronounce it I call it gold coins but it doesn't matter the problem in here is to get access to the sewers so to get access to the sewers you will need to uh, basically um, give a lot of items and give a lot of um, artifacts, I'm sorry, artifacts and minerals to Gunther. He will then reward you with the sewers key, basically. That's basically it. And after that you can then buy the, the gold, or uh, I'm sorry, you can buy the star drop by exchanging with gold. Um, another, this one is probably even easier than the other one before, is to um, give uh, a sweet gem berry, which is the, the fruit that um, is born from the rare seeds, 
if you give to the old master cannoli that is in the secret woods so that's the kind of like a statue over there if you place the you know the sweet gem berry which is like i said the fruit from the rare seeds um you will then get a, a star drop this is probably i'm not gonna say one of the easiest ones uh because it does take some time probably for you to get uh, the rare seed don't forget that the rare seed is only you can only you know planted it on on fall and and harvest it on fall also so it takes a long time but you can get um rare seeds from uh the merchant uh, the cart merchant that sells every friday and sunday if i'm not mistaken um, and it costs around 1k, I think, 1,000 or 2,000 uh, gold coins, that the, those rare seeds. But anyways, that's also one way of getting uh, a star drop. Another one is um, by receiving a letter from Willy after you obtain the Master Angler uh, achievement. Now, the Master Angler achievement, if... I am not mistaken is the achievement where you catch all the fishes available or all the different kind of fishes that are available on on the um, on the game so it's not an easy one I mean it is and it isn't so if you're using mods to make your life in fishing easier so it's an easy way for getting that uh, star drop if you don't like to use mods and you want to play the game by the way it is it may be harder mostly when it comes to the legendary fishes that are kind of a bit of a challenge to say and um, the last way you can get a star drop is by um, obtaining the achievement a complete collection and basically what that means is donating all the 95 items to the museum uh, or to the gunter and that will reward you with that achievement and therefore you will also receive uh, a star drop and that's it those are the ways you can get star drops um, some of them are easier than other than the other ones i can say that um i guess that getting the treasure chests on the 100th floor of the mines is kind of easy getting the 2000 tokens um giving the sweet gem berry to the old master cannoli may be also easy for you guys uh, the spouse, or in this case your wife or your husband, um, rewarding you with the 13 hearts. It may not be that hard also. It may be easy, maybe. Um, but the other ones may take a while, you know, to get to them. But all of them are not that complicated if you play enough time the game. Anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching. Um, please don't forget to subscribe. Turn um, turn on the notifications when you subscribe. I, it's always important to do that. Um, leave a like in this video if you liked it. Leave a comment also. And yeah, I will see you guys soon. Cheers.